Hi everyone, so let me start with this. Cloud computing is marvelous. And some may argue that these are the most remarkable advancement humankind have experienced over the past 20 years. Giving almost everyone an unheard of access to resources that didn't even exi that didn't exist previously. Well, unfortunately, most of these access is running behind only three major cloud infrastructure companies. These companies mastered their business model and created the status quo of developing any businesses in the cloud. And it is a pointlessly complex operation hidden under confusing technical jargons and marketing lingos. Almost every cloud companies give the same services that requires you to learn about them or hire people with their brand knowledge, making this access only offered to the select privileged few that can obtain or buy this information. My name is Andoyo, and I'm the CEO of Lyric, and I was an infrastructure software development engineer that has to deal with these complexities. Building and connecting multiple data center centers has been my day-to-day -day work for the past 10 years and I'm one of those privileged few that had the opportunity to learn and build this data center from the ground up. Seeing how it works and how complex it is to, de to deploy and scale a single application from one cloud to another. And I keep asking myself, why does it need to be that complex? I do know that they all are running on roughly the same hardware. As of 2021, AWS comprises over 200 products and services, same with Azure and Google at 100. Keeping up with these is overwhelming for any developers, let alone a non-technical business owner. So most of them will default to compromising and taking in these barriers lock-in and boundaries as cost of running a business. Coming from a developing country, Indonesia, I know these costs hinders many innovations and stifle growth of ideas. But there are abundant raw computing and storage hardware resources behind these companies, along with the local and regional data center providers that are completely untapped. I started asking more questions. Since the underlying machines are all the same, why can't all these resources in a cloud be abstract? And why stop at public cloud? What if the same abstraction can be given to anyone that runs their own data centers? So imagine removing these barriers between clouds and giving any local providers the ability to provide the same level of services, further leveling off the playing field. Why not build intelligence based on objective metrics and data for decision making and automation based on the right conditions? So let's capture metrics and give everyone the ability to set variables that matter most to them, from redundancy to cost, even variable that can help with local economies like where's the nearest regional local data centers with the lowest carbon emission. I would like to live in a world where data center resources are even more accessible for everyone and go back to when I fell in love with the endless possibility that it can produce, not about which vendor to pick or learn how to run them. Those problems has already been solved many, many times. Let's provide a more cohesive cloud experience so that anyone can build, test, and scale their ideas then someone in the most remote places can start developing and move them seamlessly to any provider without any friction. Let's build a new distribution channels for companies that didn't exist previously, allowing more businesses to run on a cloud that didn't support before and providing the same values for their end users on a different cloud platform. And that's how Lyrit was born, as a cloud platform ecosystem that utilizes data, machine learning, and user policy to wrap, deploy, and execute application from one cloud to another. We're connecting all the public cloud resources while abstracting them from our users. And we combine the power of serverless and our cloud agnostic deployment 
with minimal operation to provide our users the tools, the data, the analytics, redundancy, automation that were inaccessible to them. Connecting, abstracting, aggregating all data centers, our platform will give the same level playing field for regional providers, uh, partners as the big boys, thus creating this network of Airbnb-like experience for all data centers. And with that, we're creating an ecosystem of distribution for applications and allowing our users to focus on their business creation while we help them scale from an idea state to a worldwide distribution from the very beginning. And our early builders who understood the magnitude of this power have delivered complex distribution, distributed applications in record time with little to no knowledge of how to operate in a cloud. So join them as they unlock their business potential when they deploy application in a, in a global cloud to fully utilize the power of global distribution and to grow and fo focus on their applications rather than operation, their operations. Thank you.